Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be doing an AG Tube New Year's tag, and it was not created by me. I actually got the idea to do this from Alley Cat Loves AG on YouTube. So I watched a video and I thought it was like pretty cool and like it made me think on a couple of things actually. And I just thought, you know, 2020 is coming to an end, so why not go ahead and do the tag. And so basically, that's what I'm doing today. So before the video starts, you should go ahead and comment, like, and subscribe. And check out the description box and all of the links that will be in there. And with that being said, let's just go ahead and get into the tag. Okay, so the first question reads, how many subscribers have you gained this year? And I have gained 20 subscribers, which when I went to like go and check my analytics, I was like shocked that it was like 20 because I would have thought it was like less than that, like maybe like one or two, but no, it's 20. So yeah. Question number two is how many videos did you post this year? And over the course of 2020, I have posted 27 videos just on this. As you may or may not know, I took a long break from YouTube and I just like stopped posting for a while. So that's kind of thought it would have been less uploads because, you know, I did take a really long break from YouTube and I just didn't post for like a very long while. So I would have thought maybe like five or ten videos would have been how many I made in this year, but yeah. Question number three is what's your most viewed video? And my number one most viewed video is my box break video that I did like ages ago. I believe I did it in 2016 and it's like honestly not really that good, but I mean, hey, somebody likes it. A lot of people are a lot of people are enjoying it so that's like great I mean it's not really the video I would have thought would have went number one but I mean it is what it is so hey question number four reads name three AG tubers you subscribe to in 2020 and if I am to be honest I haven't really subscribed to that many youtubers over the course of 2020 let alone like watch like ag tubers um like i feel like especially like over quarantine i've been watching like less ag tube actually and like more dance moms and other things but i found three that i subscribe to so i'm gonna go ahead and say it so one is lynn's life Two is AG for all ages. And then three is actually my new channel, Adults World Photography. So you should check it out. The link will be in the description below. Question number five. What's your biggest accomplishment of 2020 on AGTube? And I would honestly have to say my biggest accomplishment would be me just taking a break and stepping back from making videos like making myself make videos because as I have said before um I don't enjoy making YouTube YouTube videos I'm more into like photography and my heart is really there so I'm like really happy I just like took that step back and like I stopped forcing myself to like make the videos because like I was like well I have a YouTube channel so I kind of have to be committed so I'm glad that like I took that break and I stepped back and um honestly quarantine helped me regain you know that little spark um, that was lost in making videos to start making videos again and me being able to realize that I can incorporate my photography into my video. So as you may or may not know, I created a brand new channel called Adults World Photography and I've been working on it. Um, and trying to get it to grow like this channel and you know actually be good because it's not that this channel is like necessarily bad it's just like I made 
this channel when I was like young and I like knew nothing about YouTube I knew nothing about the internet so I went into like everything basically raw and like now that like I'm older um I have more knowledge on like what I'm doing and like how to make a good video that people like actually want to watch and like in the past I wasn't doing that and I think that in me like taking a break from YouTube and not forcing myself to make a video um I think that more people are starting to watch my channel and watch my videos and stuff so yeah and then another accomplishment that I would have to say is that I have been making more hair videos in 2020 um I'm still not on the schedule that I would like but I'm getting there and then you know my other accomplishment I would have to say is me making my photography channel and just basically making a new channel so that I can start fresh and start brand new and just like basically have something different um so I would have to say that's what my accomplishment is and um the links to my channels will be down in the description below and I hope that you decide to check them out because I'm really working hard on my photography channel to make it like be good so yeah I just like totally like promoted myself but let's get back into it. let's get back into the questions I'm sorry cringy question six is favorite video of 2020 and I would have to say my quarantine AGPS. I really love that video. Um, or maybe I, or maybe it might be a tie with my Coachella vlog. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. Actually, no. My quarantine AGPS is my favorite video that I have made. Um, even though any of my AGPSs on my channel is my favorite, I would definitely have to say the quarantine one because I feel like I put more like thought into it but then again I don't know because Coachella was also like fabulous so I don't know question seven YouTube goal for 2021 and my goal that I have for YouTube is to grow and focus more on my photography channel and my hair channel but mostly my photography channel and um I would like to like grow this channel and like start making videos that are like good for this channel too and it's basically like different from like stuff that I have made in the past and um yeah that's like pretty much it Question number eight, what's your next YouTube purchase going to be? And um, I'm not sure. Um, if I'm to be honest, I don't buy anything um, in particular for my YouTube channel. Um, I just don't. Like, I mean, I don't get a check from YouTube, you know. And, I mean, I'm still, like, basically in the beginner levels of YouTube and... You know, YouTube is not my focus, so I just, like, don't, like, put a whole bunch of, like, money into, like, basically making my YouTube channel good. Um, so, I don't know. <laughs> Question 9 reads, what will your next doll be? And I'm not sure. Um, Christmas just passed, and I just got a Journey Girls doll. Um, and my birthday is in two months, and I haven't even thought about what I even want for it, let alone what doll I want. Now, I do have a list of, like, dolls that, you know, I want, but I honestly don't know which one is going to come next. Okay, so the last question is, what's the biggest YouTube lesson you've learned in 2020? And I would say that I could potentially make something out of this. And, like, I knew before 2020 that people that are YouTubers, they could, you know, get on YouTube's payroll and get to go to all these fun events and stuff. However, 
um, the people that I saw getting to, like, do that, they were, like, more so, like, celebrities, if you would like to say, um, or they, like, were, like, known from a show or whatever, um, and so they basically got the upper hand, but then I started seeing, like, regular people, you know, like, that's, like, my age or whatever, like, blowing up on YouTube, and stuff, and basically getting onto YouTube's payroll and getting to, like, do fun stuff and do what they love, um, and, like, basically have a career further than YouTube, you know what I mean? And so, I think that is what I learned, is that if I, like, keep on working at my YouTube channel and, like, trying to be good at it and um put in like the effort and stuff that like I could go far and like have YouTube help me to get to like my goals and my dreams that I want to do um and so yeah and I think that's like the light bulb that like clipped in my head that made me start a new channel and like start basically caring about YouTube again and so yeah I think that was my biggest lesson that I've learned in 2020 about YouTube is that I can make it I can make my channel go like so far and it would be like so much more than just you know YouTube or being a doll collector or whatever okay guys so that's the end of this video I hope that you enjoyed this video and found it, like, interesting. Um, if you did, please go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you have a YouTube channel, you should totally do this tag. And I'll try to remember to put the questions down below. But if I forget, you can go. You can just go to Alley Cat Loves AG, and she has the questions in her description. And, yeah, and... Please read the description box below and check out all the links that's in it and subscribe to my new photography channel and also to my hair channel and um, that's basically all I have to say and I'll see you very soon with more videos to come um, very soon actually I have a lot of videos planned and some pre-filmed so hopefully 2021 helps me enter the year starting out very strong on the uploading section if you know what I mean so bye guys